YouTube and welcome to my video. Today I'm going to show you a custom ROM for the Galaxy S4. Uh, this ROM is acting like the Galaxy S6 Edge. This is a ported ROM running Android 5.0.2 Lollipop version. My device is GT9 9500 Galaxy S4 Exynos version. I'm stuck at this game anyway. So we've got a lot of features from the Galaxy S6 Edge. Here it is. Like, like the age screen, people age. I can click on it and just add more people, which is very nice. A lot of uh, updated applications as my file is uh, fully updated as the Galaxy S6 Edge. The camera, I've got uh, the Galaxy S6 Edge camera, which is fully working. Oh, I've got a lot of uh, slow motion and fast motion, uh, which working. A lot of applications from the Galaxy S6 Edge. As you can see, it's fully functionally and working. Device security, I can scan it, but I don't want to. Well, let's see. Oh, of course, Super SU is fully installed on my cell phone. Viper for Android for better sound effect is also installed on my cell phone. Driver status, as you can see, enabled, enabled, normal. I've got a lot of extra features uh, from the Galaxy uh, for the custom ROM. Here's the ROM control. This is the best application for the Galaxy S4. Uh, of course, you need. Of course, your device must be rooted. I can change your ev everything I want. Status bar, battery settings, Here, display percent. Ah, oh, you can't. Ah, oh, you see it. Percent and not percent. I can change your everything I want. Even change my battery style section. Check out how many styles I've got. I can choose whatever I want. Yeah, this application sometimes... Ah, it's not raising. Okay. So I can change this whatever I want. Power menu. I can add or remove buttons. Lock screen. I can do whatever I want with my lock screen. Check out how many settings. It's going to take years if I now uh, start explaining one by one. Phone. Yeah, why not? I want its uh, locator. Increasing ringtone. Let's go to general. Of course, you can edit your build dot prop change. I wouldn't touch it anyway. Flashing emoji, Wi-Fi restoring, another audio gain. So this is the updated touch with version. I'm not using it actually. I'm really not using it. As you can see, the internet is the same as the Galaxy S6 Edge. <coughs> Fully working and fast. I'm using Apex Launcher. I think it's better. So let's go to the settings. Current message block, the same feature as the Galaxy S6, which is working. Uh, oh, multi-user. Multi-user is the only thing uh, I don't have. Here's the battery. Battery usage. Developer mode is enabled as well. Age screen. Oh, flooding messages. This is the best uh, feature for the Galaxy S6. I love it so much and it's finally in the Galaxy S4. So if you want to download this ROM, just check out uh, the vi this video's description. Here's the weather. And uh, that's it. Thanks for watching.